Good afternoon, everyone. Sister Candace and Tucker growing in grace. Um, I have a poem. I know I did my devotional already this morning, but I had this poem that I wanted to read y'all. And I told him, I said, I'm going to go uh, record a poem or you going with mama. So this is two times today that he said he, he, he will help mama. Yeah. I love my mama. The poem is entitled, Prayer. Dear Lord and Father of mankind, forgive our foolish ways, recloth us in our rightful mind, in pure lives the service fine, in deeper reverence praise, drop thy still dews of quietness till all our striving cease. Take from our souls the strain and stress, and let our ordered lives confess the beauty of thy peace. And you know, that is the only way we can have peace in this world that we're living in, is in the Lord Jesus Christ, you know, is if we know him and he is that peace. He is that perfect peace that passes all understanding. Um, you know, um... As I told y'all this morning, I'm really tired, but I've tried to just sit back and, and just relax today <clears throat> and just see if I can just, you know, I, like I told y'all, I can't nap during the day, but I can rest. And I think that just laying down and letting your body rest, even though you may not go to sleep, I think that helps our body too. Um, I feel like that you know, these are, you know, the doctor told me these are symptoms of my uh, non-alcohol cirrhosis of the liver stage two. So I'm still just clinging to the Lord. I'm trusting in him and I know that he's healing my body. And uh, I'm so thankful for my prayer warriors and the people that are praying for me. I hope that you know how much I love you and I'm praying for you. And I appreciate the ones who have commented saying they're praying for these that you know, for depression, anxiety. Uh, I even had one, you know, to put the comment that they had been suicidal. We need to lift each other up, y'all, in prayer. We're living in the last days, and there's so many of us that need prayer. And I don't think there's one child of God that don't stand in the need of prayer in the world we're living in. Know that I love you. I'm praying for you. But the Lord loves you so much more. <laughs>